Darlene Slaughter wants to meet Metro employees where they're at. It's our responsibility to get that to you as soon as possible. She's a new chief diversity, equity, and inclusion officer at Metro. Nice meeting all of you. Lately, she's been making the rounds. Just to look at folks in the eyes, shake hands, and, you know, hear some of the concerns they have and some of the questions. In June, Darlene made her first appearance at one of Metro's bus divisions. Actually visiting getting the chance to say hello to people, getting a chance for them to know me and the programs and things that we're trying to do, I think is really important. According to a recent Metro study, 59% of employees see the organization actively promoting diversity, equity, and inclusion. And 54% agree that senior leadership is representative of diverse communities. So we will have a women's group, we will have an African ancestry group. We will have a disability group. We have the veterans group. And a Hispanic group will be launching in time for Hispanic Heritage Month. For Darlene, it is about providing resources for Metro employees with shared experiences. So in addition to these groups, right, employees would make up these groups. They're open to all employees. But they will really help us to fill gaps in the organization and to hear the voices of our employees. Darlene plans to work with senior leadership to help them understand what it means to incorporate inclusivity in Metro. A lot of work to do, um, and we're just getting started, so I'm looking forward to, to everything that's going to begin to unfold. We should be helping our employees get into homes as best we can. With Metro, I'm Shirley Busico.